Who are the tribulation saints? Who are the tribulation saints? We are the tribulation saints. Who are the tribulation saints? And if you have a Bible, we're going into Revelation and the seventh chapter, because that's where this question is answered and addressed. Who are the tribulation saints? In the study of the book of Revelation, there is oftentimes confusion as to who is this vast crowd that is referenced in the seventh chapter of the book of Revelation. And many who have not had correct teaching on the saints in Revelation chapter seven uh, can erroneously assume that this is evidence perhaps that the church is going through the great tribulation because the great tribulation in Revelation has already begun by the time we get to Revelation chapter seven and because you have this reference to Christians or the saints that we're going to be talking about today, uh, those who have not had proper teaching oftentimes miss out on the proper interpretation of this. Uh, indeed, many use this in proper view to actually teach and to build teaching, to build teaching, to build teaching upon a view that the church is going through part or all of the tribulation period. Uh, but I, and uh, along with thousands of others of notable scholars, uh, strongly disagree with that view. Uh, but I, and uh, along with thousands of others of notable scholars, uh, strongly disagree with that view along with thousands of others of notable scholars thousands of others of notable scholars uh, strongly disagree with that view uh, the church will not 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 go through the tribulation uh, nor will the church go through any of the tribulation and we have much teaching on that very subject proving that the church biblically uh, cannot and will not go through the tribulation. These things I have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace. In the world ye shall have tribulation. In the world ye shall have tribulation. But be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. In the world ye shall have tribulation. In the world ye shall have tribulation. In the world you shall have tribulation. The church will not go through the tribulation. In the world you shall have tribulation. Nor will the church go through any of the tribulation. In the world you shall have tribulation. Proving that the church biblically uh, cannot and will not go through the tribulation. In the world you shall have tribulation proving that the church biblically uh, cannot and will not go through the tribulation. Let God be true, but every man a liar. Proving that the church biblically uh, cannot and will not go through the tribulation. Let God be true, but every man a liar. Who are the tribulation saints? Hey, what's up, everybody? Listen, I love Tiff Shuttlesworth, the man in the video. I just don't like the doctrine. This is what happens when you trust scholars other than reading the words of Jesus. We have to build on the words of Jesus. It's very clear that Jesus taught his church that we will go through suffering in this world. And it's clear that we have for 2,000 years, except for when America comes along at the latter days. America is a new nation, relatively, a couple hundred years old, and we have created the prosperity, wealth, and amenities, and accommodations, and comforts, and privileges that the world has never seen. 
This has impacted the church to think that they will not suffer. This is part of a strong delusion that's coming into the Christian community. The reality is we're about to go through great tribulation coming up and we need to be ready. And the only way to be ready is to face the facts that it's real and it's true and it's unavoidable. Many people who think they're not going to suffer are simply going to be pressured to take the mark of the beast. And they'll actually take the mark of the beast because they don't think that whatever they're taking will be the mark of the beast because they're not supposed to be here. So no matter what is put into their body so they can buy and sell and keep their job, no matter where it's at, even if it's on the right arm, they won't believe that it's the mark of the beast because they're persuaded that they will not be here for the great tribulation hour. Brothers and sisters, the tribulation saints are all the saints of God that are going through the great tribulation hour. It's the church, the true church. And we are the tribulation saints, those that are in Christ from every nation, kindred and tongue, Revelation 7, from all tribes around the world who believe in and keep the commands of Jesus Christ. We are the tribulation saints. All right. And we're going to talk about that this weekend. Don't forget to go to my website, subscribe, click the bell, join the blog, join my blog, and you can get notifications when I upload videos and join us in our weekend live streams. Every weekend we live stream every weekend. Go to my backup YouTube channel, click on the live stream information at my website and find out when we're meeting Saturday and Sunday. I hope to see you at the live streams on the weekends. And I upload all those live streams at my website at the blog. You can see all of our live streams at my blog, at my website, if you can't join us live. All right. I love you guys. I'll see you this weekend. God bless you. We are the Tribulation Saints. Peace.